blinded by the lights. All right, that's the, this is the only time there's a bunch of people going up towards that way. Right? It's weird. It's weird, dog. Just like the light is weird. The one fucking light all the time. You know, it looks like a motorcycle. And then it turns and it's a car. Right? Fucking optical illusion bullshit. You know? I'm like Darren. If that's if that would be me, you know? Don't be, don't be doing no magic shit around me, bitch. Right? But then it's his own fault. That's the whole thing about the show. The, the premise of the show when it was on the air live, you know, when you had to wait for it every week, is that the guy is a simp, like he's, it's his own fault for getting with a witch, right, he fell in love with a witch, it's his own fault, he can't complain and bitch about it, right, thing is, he knew she was a witch, that's the difference, right, if you fall in love with somebody that's a witch, or like, you know, you come from that, and you don't know, it's, it's different, right, and no, I'm not saying just women. <laughs> right? That's not what I mean. That's y'all perception of what I'm saying. When you say that type of shit, that's projections. I'm not about all that. Projecting. Always trying to fucking offend. Like, my mission is not to offend you unless you pissed me off. And then I'm trying to piss you off, maybe, huh? Just a little bit. I'm trying to piss you off just a little bit. Right? But I don't do that shit intentionally all the time. If I'm being annoying. If you tell me, yo, that shit's annoying, I'll try, I'll stop. I'll try my best not to tap my finger on the fucking dashboard, you know? Take that as singing the song. I'll try my best not to sing the song out loud. I'll keep it in my fucking head when a song is stuck in there. Right? I was always apologetic if I offended you. But I'm reaching the level of, like, fuck that shit. Why, why is it my bad if you're offended, right? You want me to tolerate you? To what culture, though? Right? This this culture that you claim has, has given me... Uh, like a lottery ticket. I guess it is, you know? But that's for everybody here. They, the thing, the people that say that shit don't realize how lucky they also have it. It's not because I'm a guy. It's not because I'm light skin, right? It's not because I'm white. What the fuck is white anyway? You know, like what the fuck is black anyway? Would you forget about the nations? You know, they, they say it's a country, but there's nations in the country, right? Especially in a country like this one that we're living in. There's plenty of people that have different nations living together. Fine. It's all good, you know? It's just like, you know, I had preferences too. But then I saw how people treat the differences in this world. Right, sometimes I should have known better too, looking back. In certain ways. Right? Sometimes you just can't help yourself from from doing right, like a drug or something like that. Something. It's like a compulsion. It's a beast. You gotta keep it at bay. Right? I don't sit there. I got a whole 24 pack at home. I don't sit there drinking. It's been there for days, unopened. I don't sit there drinking it like that. 
unless I'm feeling a bunch of pain in my neck from throwing this shit around. I always use my body for money, but not like a prostitute, even though in the sense of the word, I, it is. Right, you, I prostitute my body out for money so that I could get clothes with and food, right? Or a piece of candy or whatever the fuck. Iced teas. Right, whatever the fuck it is. Pack of cigarettes. Pack of cancer sticks, right? A little fucking vapor pen or something like that, whatever. Right, it should cost money. P- put the gasoline in the tank, right? Like, mistakes happen and shit. Sometimes you have to use money you were saving. Because... Motherfuckers make mistakes. Right? Or something something happens. Like, an accident happens. Like, you make a mistake. You made an an accident. You had an accident or something like that. Right? Whatever it is, you know? I always keep one of these little dude wipes on me. I keep one in the cab for the truck driver, too, in case he needs it. Kept one extra. Like, I'm nice. I'm considerate. I go out of my way to try to think of other people. I don't look for shit in return. That's why God gives me, like, little things. I'm appreciative of little things. The sunrise. The sunset. The rain clouds. You know? I'm appreciative when it rains, because then I don't have to water the plant. Do you get it? Right, these people been through a drought and they were complaining about rain. Amazing, the time I'm living in. It's amazing. It's insane to me how people think that it's going to change from something. When all they do is... I don't know. I, like, I'm not even complaining about the shit that I show half the time. Unless it's threatening. Unless it feels like putting my life in some type of danger. You're putting my my safety at some type of risk. That's the only time you hear me complaining about shit, really. Right? Maybe I complain to my mom about all this shit. Right? But if I had a wife, I wouldn't complain to her about it. Unless she asked me what's wrong, I'd be like, you really want to know? I feel like I've been living in hell my whole life. Right? It's a prison I can't leave. It felt like that long before I ever did drugs or hung out with a wrong person, right? Trusted a bad seed or whatever the fuck it is. Did something bad myself. You know, Satan tempted me and I fell for a trick, right? Woman tempted me and I fell for her bullshit. Whatever it is. Put yourself in my shoes. Right, I'm not out here trying to victimize anybody and abuse the shit out of somebody. I'm trying to make people aware of what's going on. All right? I'm not thinking every single time it happens. It's just, it's funny when it happens all the time. All right? It's all the time, dude. I'm not here complaining about the same exact thing, though. Am I? The slow school bus with no kids on it. All right? They drive fast with the kids on it, but they drive slow. When there's, when I'm behind it when there's no kids on it, right? All right, I'm not complaining about it. I look at it like God is keeping me from, like, what if there's going to be an accident? What if I'm going to cause a fucking accident by being in front of that bus? Not paying attention as well, right? I'm decent at paying attention, talking to this shit, explaining something about life while I'm driving, paying attention. I'm good at that. I don't know why. I'm good at the awareness level. My awareness level is higher than other people sometimes. It's a lot fucking higher. It's higher up. Even when you think I'm not paying attention. I don't know why I put my blinker on, though. See? Just speaking of shit like that will happen to me, though. It'll be accidental. Right? A- accidents. Mistakes. I'm just glad it's only the blinker going off by accident. And not the fucking tire going off. Thank God. Thank the creator for that. Keeps my shit safe half the time. It gives me leniency with my lifestyle. He gives me this preference level that I'm allowed to have. All right? Because I try to follow the scripture and keep it in my heart. Not just base my whole fucking life off of it. 
right? I try to please what is created in God, like what created us. I p- try to please what is creating the reality we're in every day, making the sun come up, making the moon rise after the sun goes down, right? Making the rain clouds form when the when the earth needs water. Instead of letting it flood out with the sea. Right? Because that's what the rainbow means to me. Everything takes a little bit of time. But everything takes time in general. Right? I remember being a little school kid getting fucking picked on. Right? Until you show something that they respect. It doesn't always have to be violence. Right, I was a little bit funny, maybe. Or I was good at, like, rapping or some shit. You know what I mean? I could handle my drugs better. I could always handle drugs better than I could handle liquor and alcohol. That's why I only drink, like, two, three beers these days. I drink two, three beers, get a little slow feeling, and then I go to sleep. I don't go out driving unless I had a beer or two at the bar. But then I wait. You know, I'm, I'm usually eating food. I used to not eat a lot of food and still be fucking fat. I don't know how, because I'll eat pizza and drink beers maybe, right? Whatever the fuck it is. I have no idea, dude. Right, I know it's a schedule thing, too, why you see things on certain days. Like, I know, because the guy made a joke. I know it's Monday when I see you. <laughs> It's like, yeah, but for me, I don't remember what day it is sometimes because I work seven days a week while I can since the farm isn't going to be picking food all year round. Now, is it? Right? So then that check will be less. My, my weekly pay will be lessened. And it's a lesson learned. Right? I used to not care. I used to want to take days off and then get pissed off when it was fucking raining and shit. For landscaping, right? Because I'd take a day off when it was nice, and then it would be raining the next day, and then I'd have two days off my check. Right? Make plans, God laughs.